Hey YouTube, what's up? This is uh, WienerCat37, and um, I'm making this video to tell you guys that I got Firebelly Toads. Yeah, in uh, another of my videos, I was asking you guys, what do you think I should get for the Reptile Expo? That's coming in a couple days. It was either between Firebelly Toads, Firebelly Newts, the Tiger Salamander, or uh, Pac-Man Frog. Well, I went ahead and got... Firebelly Toads before the expo, so you guys can cross that out. Um, yeah, hold on, I'll show you guys. Let's put a light on this. Yeah, when I saw them, I was I saw one that I really liked, and they say it's better to keep them in pairs. So yeah, that's the one, and then I got that one. They both have really nice fire bellies, I guess all of them do. Um, they're staying in this really tiny cage, but it's all good because they're literally like not even an inch big yet. And they're only going to be staying in here until um, March 7th, and today is the 4th, so yeah, three days. Because I'm going to the Reptile Expo, and um, I'm getting two large, uh, one extra large and one large critter keeper. Because I'm thinking of getting a Pac-Man frog. And, um, yeah, and the other one, the large, is going to be for these guys. And I'm thinking of getting a couple more Firebelly Toads, because I like the possibilities you can do with these setups that are, like, like, it really looks natural, I think. Yeah. Alright, that's a little tiny water bowl. That's, um... Hydrometer, uh, toilet paper roll, piece of a fake plant, and keep on eco life. Uh, keep on. Keep on eco life. Just got one brick because I know it was more than enough. Oh yeah, here. Here's a little pinky that I'm gonna feed my uh, California king snake later. Yeah, so that's uh, the Fire Belly Toads. I'm probably going to make another video on uh, Saturday or Sunday. Showing you guys my new herb and the new setup for these toads. Because I'm getting, I said I was going to get a large critter cage, critter cage or critter keeper. I'm probably going to get a log hop just to make it look more natural. I'm going to keep the Eco Earth. I'm going to get well, like one of those... Um, one of those uh, water bowls and um, they don't need like any special lighting so right now I'm using one of those um, those swirly um, light bulbs the ones that are environmentally friendly or whatever because they're really weak and if I use a strong one they would probably melt the top plastic because it's only 10 watts so yeah, so this is the Firebelly Toad cage and the Firebelly Toad, so, um, let me know what you guys think. I would take them out for you, but, um, I'm not really that much of a handling pet. They're more of a look at pet. Uh, I'll probably get more videos of these guys eating, and I'll probably hold them, like, later, but I just got them, so I'm just gonna let them settle in. So, yeah, um, I'll see you guys later.